At CH2M Health Plateau Remediation Company, we understand the crucial role our work plays in environmental cleanup of the Hanford site for our community. Every year, our company, along with the Department of Energy, set the bar high when it comes to establishing cleanup goals. This helps ensure we protect human health and the environment, which includes this precious resource, the Columbia River. For fiscal year 2016, workers advanced Hanford cleanup significantly. We did this work safely and compliantly. Several projects worked more than 1 million safe hours, and we received a National Safety Award, the VPP Star of Excellence, for a second year in a row. It's a major deal for us to receive that. Uh, that was achieved a lot in part by utilizing our workforce and getting worker involvement, worker feedback, so that we can perform our work safely and compliantly. So it's a great accomplishment for our company. We are working towards demolition of the plutonium finishing plant, which is one of the most contaminated facilities on the Hanford site. In FY16, workers demolished three ancillary facilities, completed the most hazardous work inside the main facility, and made significant progress in preparation for demolition. Demo will start in FY 2017. Oh, it's great progress. I mean, for the project, for us, uh, to get the guys back into the seat, uh, get them back up and running, uh, just to move forward and uh, get to our final goal of putting slab on grade for PFP. Groundwater is crucial to the protection of the Columbia River. You'll see these special types of pipes across the Hanford site, and they play a crucial role in cleanup. They help carry contaminated groundwater to pump and treat facilities. Workers reduced contamination plumes across the site by treating over 2.1 billion gallons of contaminated groundwater. That's enough water to irrigate over 15,000 golf courses. Workers removed over 180,000 pounds of contamination from groundwater. It included removal of nitrates, hexavalent chromium, and carbon tetrachloride. The part of our success comes from uh, engineering and craft working together every day, installing new systems, bringing as much water as we can to our process, and cleaning up billions of gallons of water a year. We've worked hard this year, we've optimized our groundwater facilities, and by doing so, we are now treating additional sources of contaminated water. Another way workers are helping protect the river is by removing a mixture of highly radioactive metal fragments, soil, and sand called sludge. Currently, the sludge sits in a basin next to the K-West reactor, which is right behind me. It's important to remove that sludge because it's located about 400 yards from the Columbia River. The project has completed the procurement of equipment and tools that will be used to remove sludge from the basin. Very, very excited. To finally see all this large equipment go in after all the long, hard hours that everybody here at the Basins has done to get ready for this. Towards the end of FY 2016, Siege 2 m successfully transferred more than 300 workers and several major projects from contractor Washington Closure Hanford. Siege 2 m named Brian Vance director of the 300-296 project. In 2016, we focused on building a winning project team, representing all the great folks in this company that can have a material impact on our ability to successfully deliver. We've started design activities, we've started procurement activities, and we have a sound plan where we're gonna see material progress in 2017, and we're excited to be a part of a, a really exciting project and an important project for the company and the region. Crews at the waste encapsulation and storage facility improved the facility's ventilation system. A key step in maintaining safe and compliant cesium and strontium capsule management and eventually moving the capsules to dry storage. 
We led the way in environmental performance through a successful environmental management system in earning ISO 14001 renewal certification. In CH2M's continuing effort to be the business partner of choice, we've awarded more than $1.3 billion to small businesses. As CH2M employees, we not only work here, we live here. So our dedication goes further than environmental cleanup. We support local educational institutions and give back to over 50 organizations such as charities and small businesses. More than 350 employees spent over 1,300 hours making an impact in the community. This was a great year for cleanup. The progress we've made would not be possible without the knowledge, expertise, and commitment of our workforce. Thanks to you, we are starting 2017 successfully.